Prior to attending Birkbeck, I'd done an art foundation course and I did some A-levels at Waltham Forest College, but that was a long time ago. And then um, I'd, I was uh, always been a sort of a bit of an autodidact. I was always interested in finding out ideas and I had that curiosity, whether it was buildings, paintings, history, you know, you, you just got that thirst. I mean, curiosity is the essence of culture, but it wasn't structured. I had a kind of eager mind, but it was an undirected mind. And then um, I finally decided to go back into higher education. But like a lot of working class people, I felt a bit intimidated, you know, because you, you don't think you're intelligent enough. This is really tough, but it's, it's a, on a subtle psychological level, there's a kind of injury that the class system does to people. It makes them feel like they're not capable. And of course, that's not true. Our ability to learn and develop is not predetermined by limits on our DNA. And the thing about Birkbeck is it is inclusive and it's, it has that egalitarian ethos. And I think that people like Stuart Hall and Michael Young would have been really proud of what the lecturers here are achieving. You know, it's that idea that education is for all and our development is everlasting.